You guys should ask yourself, can we put a church in any Muslim country? I dare any of you say yes. Think about it. My kids are watching the news. My kids are telling me, well, Dad, what do we do now? You guys are forcing us out of this neighborhood. I don't see anything beneficial about it at all for any of us. I have young children. They watch the news, and now they're getting scared. These people that are coming in are not beneficial to this area at all. Worship, no worship, whatever it may be. A facility to store weapons, training, whatever it is. Do not need this in our city. Pick another one. But this one here that you plan on want to put in, not you guys, but they do, it's going to look like Disneyland. I don't know. You guys are really tricking me out. What they should do is probably have Homeland Security check these people out, just in case. You don't know what's going on. You know, they're cutting people's heads off. They killed our soldiers and everything. Come on, this is outrageous. These people scare us. I'm telling you, they scare me, they scare everybody. It's not right to live with people like this. And, and this mosque has people like this. This is not acceptable at all. Not even 1%, because these people, they are scaring the public. We see them at the mall every day. We see them, we see them at the shopping around here in Stilling Heights. Can we prohibit this? Can we make a law against this? Because this is scary and it's disgusting. I find that the bigotry, hatred, ignorance on display both tonight and last Thursday to be harmful to the reputation of our city. And these people and their views are not reflective of the city population at large who believe and follow the U.S. Constitution. I urge the Planning Commission to approve the site plan if it meets the requirements as set forth by the city charter. This is a house of worship for residents of our city, nothing else. I find it despicable that citizens of the United States are being discriminated against. The United States has a long history of protecting minority rights, and I hope Sterling Heights upholds those values. Thank you very much.